Hey everyone, this is Dave Boyd from the Devilish Rogue Project. I'm a little under the weather today, but I did get some good news in the mail. I got my first prototype gag order um, deck of cards printed by the uh, by Make Playing Card Company. So we're going to take a look at it today and try and um, give a little bit of a comparison to a bicycle deck, standard stock finish, um, the air cushion finish, and the Legends, <clears throat> pardon me, the uh, Legends diamond cut finish. So let's take a look, shall we? Let's get my knife. And so uh, the tuck case came wrapped in cellophane. Um, it looks like it's a digital printing process, probably for smaller print runs um, used. I'm assuming that anything larger than a uh, <clears throat> thousand will probably use CMYK plates. So just a preliminary uh, look. The ink looks pretty solid. The blacks are very good. Um, the drawing is rendered pretty well. Uh, the sides look great. And there's the company information. Ta -da. And the back, of course, is the dual actuator hard drive. So let's take a look at the cards inside. So the cards inside also come wrapped in cellophane as well. Uh, you can already kind of tell that they have a uh, linen finish as well. You can't really, I'm not really sure if you can see it on there, but they have a bit of a bit of a, <clears throat> like a cloth look. So let's take a look. Okay. So right away you can tell that they seem to seem to fan out pretty well. And everything looks like it's pretty well printed. Let's see, it's probably a little fuzzy on the camera there, but um, if you can see in the light, there's kind of a little bit of an indentation, similar to the um, air finish on Bicycle. And they shuffle pretty well. And they seem to fan out pretty well, too. They uh, have a nice, smooth feel to them. So let's take a look at some of the artwork on this as well. So all the all the cards look amazing actually. The um, the edges are really sharp and smooth. Okay, so let's take a quick comparison look at how the gag order and MPC printing will stack up against Bicycle and Legends. So the gag order deck um, has a very sharp finish on the end. Uh, it's very cheap for the uh, the cost uh, for the quality of printing and pretty good. So this is just a print print run of one. Uh, this was just to just to get a prototype out. Um, compared to the bicycle stock, um, it would feel it feels a little bit smoother on the edges. Uh, bicycle has this kind of rough feel, um, but I think the cutting process is probably pretty similar. And to compare to Legends, the Egyptian um, diamond cut, it's very similar to Legends. Um, in this case, it's about the same roughness on the edges. They both fan out very well. Uh, Legends is very smooth when it fans, of course. And um, so is all the NPC stuff. So if you have time or you um, just want to make your own deck of cards, I would highly recommend checking these people out. They're uh, very, very good quality for the price that you are putting in. So uh, thanks everyone for watching and thanks for your support. And um, I'll let you guys know when I have a full print run prepared. Uh, if you guys are interested in a new deck coming out from me, it's called Oni. And it's on humorousrobot.com. You can check it out and all the information there. There will be updates. And um, you can also check me out on Twitter at humorousrobot or devilishrogue. So uh, thanks for watching everyone and peace out.